Hello my beautiful beauties and my wonderful lovelies, a pleasant afternoon to you. There is a scripture that I want people to really understand the etymology, the original meaning behind that saying where Paul in the New Testament said, I become all things unto all men, men and women, that's what he's saying, that I might save some. Because right away Paul is telling you not everyone will receive him and receive everything he says that's the baseline that's a basic uh fundamental truth of that statement now to dissect that statement a little further what Paul is saying is that look here I'm an educated man a highly educated man summa cum laude with my PhDs but I'm going to go into a particular garrison area for example or a particular inner city area, um, I cannot come with my aloof self or highfalutin words, words that are above the people's um, emotional intelligence or intelligence quotient, meaning their IQ, their level of understanding, their level of knowledge, or their level of wisdom where they're at. And I'm unable to communicate effectively with them in order to reach them for the kingdom of God. I have to know take this hat off and come down to their level even the way how i dress i can't dress so stiff and so apart from reaching them that by the time they see me they say oh who is this man mm -mm 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 -mm. and they become sort of you know they reject me I have to now come down to their level. So I might put on a jeans and a t-shirt. Not to say that it is belittling, but it is where they are at, where they can understand me. Probably will wear a shades, you know. Maybe I can put in a little earring, perhaps, depending. And then I, when I come to them, I say, what's up, boss, man? Wagwa, my general. Wagwa, my general. Wagwa, my G. You good? Talk to me, man. Wagwa, with you and your baby mother. Wagwa, with your kids, them. Wagwa, with your mother. Hold the money around. Talk to me. Boy, your chopper ways and your scammer ways. Make me understand why you beat beat up on the woman so much. And he has to get down into their level. And now if he goes to Norbrook, not to say that, you know, any and everyone can't go there with the right application in a ethical way and a legal way I'm talking here now. Um, and he's speaking to the upper echelon <laughs> in society. The people from Zena, upper Zena Andrew that he would not put on that language for them in order to reach them for the kingdom of God because they too are important, just like the man in the inner city. And that is what Paul is saying. But it doesn't mean that they're going to, he's going to take on anything that is sinful. All right, beautiful people, follow me on TikTok, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share this.